The one thing that I really loved about the character Machete was that he was like a regular guy. He was just a cop. You know, he was just a cop, a, a federal, a federal agent in Mexico, and it, he was nothing special other than a guy that had to right wrong. You know, he wasn't a superhero. He didn't have to wear tights. You know, he wasn't uh, didn't have a cape. You know, he doesn't fly. He, none of that. You know, he's, he, he he doesn't cast a web or anything. You know I mean, he's just he's just a regular guy that can kick ass, you know, but I think I would match him against any one of the superheroes because he doesn't use his superpowers, he uses his head. Robert just like outdid himself. I'm trying to figure out what they're gonna do for Machete 3 because this has literally everything. We've got, you know, I have a sword fight with Mel Gibson, you know, and uh, I remember when Robert said, action, I threw down my sword. And Robert said, why are you throwing down your sword, Danny? I said, I'm not fighting William Wallace. He, are you kidding? He saved Scotland. <laughs> Charlie Sheen, who, who plays the President of the United States, who is, is an amazing actor. I was just, he plays the President, and in, a, in one scene he jumps up and yells, I'm the president of the United States. He was so convincing that you could almost hear the big ships going, dun, dun, do, 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 and shooting, you know, on, on Iwo Jima. It was like, it was amazing. I gotta tell you, she was an amazing, amazing act. She's just a natural, well, she's an entertainer, so she's a nat natural actress, you know, and then, uh, and then we had a, we had such a blast working with her. And uh, I got her pots and pans because she ordered pots and pans because she does her own cooking. So when she was leaving, I said, "Gaga, who's taking her pots and pans? Nobody." So I took all her pots and pans. I got them at home. Lady Gaga's pots and pans. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Mel Gibson, Charlie Sheen, uh, uh, and a, a lot of the women love Lady Gaga. It's like, yeah, who doesn't? It's like, I love her. And uh, we got a Amber Hurt. We have uh, uh, Sophia Varag. Everybody loves her. I mean, women love her. God, it's like, uh, we've got Antonio Banderas, Cuba Gooding Jr., and it just goes on and on. And, uh, I think it's an action-packed movie with chick consideration. It's not a, you wouldn't call it a chick flick, you know what I mean? But it's got a lot of chick con, con, consideration. <laughs> They're both great. If somebody asked me, well, who would you rather have in a fight? I said, well, in a fight, you know, I would love Jessica Alba because Jessica Alba would make sure I wouldn't get hurt. She would go call 911 immediately. You know, the police would be there. Michelle would pick up a pitcher and hit somebody. <laughs> you know, and then call 911. It's about action and it's about it's about taking taking the bulls by the horn or taking the bull by the horns or something and just doing it, you know, everything. It's like everything about it. It's like, I don't think there's a scene in it that doesn't relate to action. You know? He's a really nice guy. He's a really nice guy, man. He got nominated for an Academy Award, so I thought he might be full of himself. He's just a great guy. He was just so humble.